Shit. One second. I fucked this up. Yeah. Apparently it wasn't recording, but it is. Anyway, hi guys. Welcome back to the Motorsport Manager playthrough. And yeah, yeah sometimes it's little cock ups. I think I'm going to leave it in. I can't be asked to edit it out, to be honest. I'm going to leave it in. So we're in Phoenix today. And I don't know if you remember the last episode. Uh, we, well, we didn't perform, did we? Um, so we're going to write that off and hopefully we're going to move forward here. Um, let's have a look at the car parts to fit some new parts, shall we? So we've got the best, the best, the best engines in. We're not using the best um, gearbox yet because it's not quite ready. And also reliability is piss poor. We are using our new suspension, so and they are getting better. They are getting better, as is the reliability. Let's say out to the improvement of the parts. Have a look. So you can see reliability. We are working on reliability of the suspension. Once they get around about 94%, I'll probably stop that. Um, and we'll concentrate on getting these gearboxes up to snuff. Probably should. These these are nearly done, so we can just soon stop and working on the engines. So that's fine. And we can start moving into other parts. We'll get both of these gearboxes working for one. Um, in fact, let's do that now. Thank you. Uh, let's do this. Get them around about equal. That'll do. So, what's the story? What's the dealio? Well, it is now five past eleven on Monday the June, Monday the June, Monday the fifth of June, and I have been recording since five to seven this morning. That's a long, long day of just recording videos. And I've recorded a lot of stuff, and it's been a good day recording mostly, and it's been the odd bit of disappointment, but it has been a good day mostly recording. It's been a productive YouTube day, and not only that, it's been a reasonably productive home day. Got four lots of washing done, changed the bedding, uh, cooked dinner, washed up, had a shower, had a wank, no, sorry, wait, wait, had four wanks. I didn't really have four wanks, I did have a wank, though. What did I? Uh, too much information. Yeah, always with me, isn't it? It's always too much information with me. But did I, didn't I? Chances are, been at home all day. Come on, guys. You know, you know if you've been at home all day, you can never have knocked one out, aren't you? <laughs> Simple as. Uh, also, talked to my daughter. Um, so, I've had a good, I've had a fantastic day, actually. Um, it's been quite good. I'm going to head to bed after this one, though. Because, well, I am starting to get tired. You might be able to hear it in my voice. I've spent a lot of talking. And uh, yeah, I'm a little bit, a little bit shattered at this point. Um, so let's push into this. And I'm saying I've got someone replying to me on Steam. I've got to deal with this. I'm sorry, guys. Uh, we'll do tomorrow, mate. He, basically, uh, I'm thinking about doing an arc playthrough as well. I do like arc. Put a lot of hours uh, into that. So one second. I'm really sorry about this. this. Isn't exactly the most professional thing in the world to do. I know, but it's more content potentially. Potentially. Um, get one more recording in before bed. Been up since stupid o'clock. To be fair, I have been up since stupid o'clock. I got up at four a.m. Um. I don't know why. I know I'm, I'm an early riser anyway. Um, I always have been. I think it's just a case of because I used to work in a bakery a long time ago, and I worked in the market before that. Um, and I've also did nights. I'm just more used to early starts. That's all it is. I just I, I wake up early. I go to bed reasonably late most of the time, and I wake up pretty damn early. And for some people, it doesn't work for me. Four to six hours sleep tonight. Not forty-six, but four to six hours sleep a night. It's usually what I need. Usually what I need. I went f for well, how long? How long was it before me? And it's, so me and the ex split up after about six months of living in a particular house and me working nights. And um, I was getting two hours nights, uh, two hours sleep a night, pretty much the entire during time during that. So yeah, one second, guys. This is fucking there we go I don't know why it does that occasionally it will just judder it will just judder um, it's really really annoying actually but it just does that occasionally 
It's, I don't know what it is. It could be because the, the this this PC has been on now for 72 hours. It's actually been on for 72 hours. I was uploading overnight before I started recording, um, and obviously I'm now uploading again. Uh, well, actually, I'm uploading while I'm recording this. That's the thing. Um, it's just how I am. I, I, I don't know what it is. I'm just shoving out loads of content. I'm really enjoying doing this whole thing. I'm really shit at it. Uh, the whole YouTube thing at the minute. It does take a little bit of learning, I believe. Um, but I'm really enjoying it as well. It's it's an experience. So, you're not a fan of that. And how about that? Let's push right up. Let's try that. We only need to get a couple of laps out, and then we've got, well, excellent knowledge basically. So let's get you back out on those and get those. Just need a bit more in that speed balance. I think push towards that. Maybe dip that down a little bit. Push that way. See how that one, see how so he feels about that. This should be Vosu's race, really. He is the Phoenix expert, supposedly. Um. But yeah, so when I used to get by on two hours sleep a day, I used to look after my daughter during the day. Um, I would then, uh, my ex would then come home around about seven o'clock. I would go to bed, get about two hours sleep, go to work f from sort of like ten-ish until um, sort of half six, seven o'clock in the morning. Sometimes eight o'clock. I would come home. I would. Uh, get my wife off to work. I would then look after my daughter for the day and I'd sleep as and when I could. That was basically how I was living for six months and it was fucking tough. Really fucking tough. And then, oh, I don't really want to talk about it to be honest. She decided she wasn't happy anymore. She decided to leave. Apparently I was a miserable bastard. Unfucking surprising, really, isn't it? You know. But yeah, we, we, won't, we won't talk about that. Uh, we won't talk about how I got depression and, you know, when she was depressed, I helped her through hers and then when I was depressed, she didn't help me through it. I'm not going to talk about that. I'm not going to talk about that. The fact of the matter is, she is, despite those faults, she is still a good mother to my daughter. I can't, I can't knock her that. Um, go that way. Yeah. So we do have level 3 on soft tyres and race trim. We're going to push out for some qualifying trim as well, hopefully, and the medium tyres. We may want them. We may want them. Let's get the strategies back up again. We know we like it. So, um, yeah, things, stuff and things, stuff and things, depressing stuff and things, really. So let's talk about more positive stuff and things. And who is it that says stuff and things? Oh, Slipgator. If you've never watched Slipgator, we're talking about Ark, if you've never watched Slipgator, probably the guys who watch on YouTube when it comes to Ark stuff. A bit mental, but... Yeah, that's what you want sometimes in a in a, in a guy, don't you? That's what you want in a YouTuber. Me, I'm more sort of level, slightly monotonous, I guess. <laughs> um, I just don't see the whole big OTT things. Not a fan of them. We've got level two. We just needed the refuel, really. It was it was more of a case of anything. So excellent, great, excellent. Uh, sorry, excellent, okay, great, even. Give you three laps worth of fuel again. So where is the handling? I need to push this handling even further away into understeer. Let's get the corner and back where we want it. There. New tyres. Off you go. Same for you. Get you some more, more fuel, more laps. New tyres. So we've got these good. It's just getting... This, does this want to go even further that way? It's like there. What do we think? Like that? Let's try that. So we do have level 2 for medium tyres and qualifying trim. We should hopefully get level 3 for both of these. Um, we already do have level 3 for the race trim and the soft tyres, so if we can get them both, qualification will be a massive, massive boost. Um, so Vosu, I'm expecting to do well uh, with both Super Overtake mode and the fact that he is a Phoenix expert and he's got a slightly better car now. I'm expecting him to do extremely well. We do have a level 3 for both the qualifying trim and the medium tyres. 
they're happy with the cornering and handling. There's not really much else we can do at this point. It's too late in practice to do that. So we'll let them do this. We'll pull them back in. And just get into qualifying, I guess. Yeah. So would you guys... I mean, obviously, uh, I know we stopped the Pokemon thing because it doesn't really quite fit in with how everything works. But I am interested in getting back into playing Ark. Um, would an Ark series be something you guys would be interested in? Do let me know if it is. Um... I say I'm still I'm still touring the idea of doing Dark Souls three. A friend of mine commented in the videos and spoke to him separately, and he wants me to see Dark, he wants to see Dark Souls three. And I love Dark Souls three. I do. I adore Dark Souls three, but I do have a lot on my plate with regards to the amount of uh, playthroughs I'm doing at the minute. I kind of went a bit OTT uh, in one hit. Uh, one of the reasons why um, the ninety eight percent balance beautiful. One of the reasons why I stopped the Pokemon playthrough is actually because I just didn't have time to do it. So, talking about potentially doing more playthroughs might be a bad idea, but it will mean we end up slowing down maybe on certain things. So, like, we probably wouldn't do a daily uh, Motorsport Manager. Uh, it might be, like, twice daily, or so every other day. Uh, or we might set up so it's a Monday, a Wednesday, uh, a Friday, and a Sunday every week. So we've got four episodes a week of Motorsport Manager. Um, the, the Football Manager, I'm going to see if I can get those going every... Um, three days I think or maybe we'll just do it so that we've got Tuesday and Saturday for one of them and then um, Wednesday and Sunday for the other that's what I'm thinking maybe we do that so that we're constantly some content there and with Crusader Kings 2 I think again maybe we just fill in the gaps so where we've had say for example uh, the Sunday uh, the Monday, uh, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, Sunday of the Motorsport Manager the Tuesday, the Wednesday, the Friday, we put in the Crusader Kings videos. So that every day, you've got two videos turning up. It does make my life a bit easier um, to do it that way as well. That's, that's how I want to set up. It's just then trying to find a time to do DS3 or Dark Souls 3 and um, also Ark. That's, that's the thing. I think Ark may just be in sort of as and when. I mean, I play it a lot, and it will need a lot of editing in an arc video, that's the thing. But, I don't know. Lauren Versus should go through the Q2. Let's send them out again, fuck it. Let's have a little tweak, do that. Let's get you out on these tyres, let's get you out again. We can get another lap out. It's not often you get to play around this much, but... I think that's a little bit too much. Touch it too much. Use those tyres. Hopefully, we can get a slightly faster lap. I would like both drivers to go through the Q2. I would like us to actually get the sponsorship target this time around as well. Um, we desperately need money. Overheated perfect. It's going to be overheated good. Come on, Vosi, mate. You've got it in your fucking tank. We should have given him the um, super overtake mode, shouldn't we? Fuck. Didn't think about that. Uh, neither driver's happy, but we're definitely not going to be able to get him back out, though. Uh, in lap in lap. So Nahui is the only other person in lap. We're going to go through in 11th and 15th. It's not the worst but it's not the best is it really. We are through to Q2 though. Now I'm going to have a sip of John Smith's. Not sponsored. Not sponsored. Um, anyone surprising there? I suppose you could argue that Swan and then slightly surprising to go out in Q1 but eh. Let's take the qualifying. Let's get these fuckers out again. So that was... I don't know if that's an improvement or not. That was the previous thing. I think that's a touch too much, isn't it? Let's try that. We can do one line, can't we? And you... We're going to end up going through all of our fucking soft tyres, aren't we? Just in qualifying. Crazy stuff. That is an improvement. No, it's not. It's a downgrade. Shit. Um, off you go, mate. Let's get these fuckers on auto again. So, as long as one of them finishes 
above 11th for this qualifying, I'm happy. I don't want to start burning through too many tyres, that's the problem. Um, in fact, I think we might just get one lap out and then stop. I don't. We don't have the soft tyres to do anything more. It's disappointing, but I think we get locked into the tyres we use. I mean, we could send them out on mediums and just take the knock, I guess. Send them out on mediums, take the knock. Because we've got three sets of tyres left. No, we'll send them out on mediums, let's take a knock. Let's put them out again, but I'll say on this time on mediums. Um, I mean, even then we might need those. Still, let's push them around, see what they can do. Vosu is an expert on this track after all. <clears throat> let's see what he can do. If he's such an expert, why isn't he getting perfect, perfect? So we know it's going to be slow because medium tyres. I think we're going to let this go around. We're not going to bother after this one. What's the point? I mean, yeah, neither, neither happy with those. So hopefully Lara will stay in 10th. I mean, I'll be happy if she drops, I was about to say I'll be happy if she drops down to 11th. I will be happy if she drops down to 11th. As long as she doesn't drop her down too many more. We might have to keep an eye on results. Vosu has dropped down one. Two still going round. We're just going to leave it. We're going to leave it. We're going to keep an eye on things. Hopefully no one will chuck out before. So we've got to keep an eye on 12, 13, 14 and 15. So 13 is going round. 13 coming in, and it's fine, they didn't get a faster lap, so we still hold on to 11th. Uh, anyone else going to go out? No, so we get 11th, and Vosu gets 14th. That's not bad, that's not bad. I'll take those, I'll take those odds, they're good odds. That noise is annoying in the background now, I don't need to hear mechanics working on cars they're not working on. Um... So yeah, so what else have I done today? I never got around to cleaning out the fish tank. That's something I can do tomorrow. I do have a funeral to go to tomorrow, but I can do that. I can do that afterwards in the evening. That's fine. Uh, any other surprises? No, Lara out, basically. But we do get this one to ship target. We're going to simulate the session. We're not going to worry about it. We're not in it. Um, Blasi, new sectors, new sectors. <laughs> Blasi, just unreal. So, so quick. Evil Blasi, Evil Blasi, Evil Blasi. Just so quick. Unfucking believable. We need. We do desperately need to work on our car. We need to chuck loads of money into our car. Just don't have the money to chuck into our car. Next season, as I said, I do want to, to target um, promotion. But we'll see how it goes. Let's quickly head back to the car setup. So, it's 38 laps. We get 10 to 12 or 14 to 16. Now. Obviously, if we were to get 2 lots of 14, that's 28, and then that would give us these. So I feel like we're going to push out on the mediums first. We're going to give 20 laps worth of fuel. Excessive, maybe, but fuck it, don't care. Um, same with you, you can take the 14 16s, so you're going to get 22 laps worth of fuel. Because you're, pardon me, you're going to have super overtake mode. That is, that is the plan. So... We have race trim. We are going to switch tyres, so we're going to take the pit stop guru. Race trim, and okay, he hasn't got super overtake mode. I wonder why. Oh, it's because he's pissed off with his mechanic, isn't he? Okay, well we get medium tyres. Um, yeah, for some reason he's angry with his mechanic. Don't know. Don't know. Don't care. Just deal with your fucking issues. I need that back. So Blasi, Holgerson, Amura, Critchley, no broken neck, and Channon. Giuliani's got a broken neck today. Alright. So hopefully our Phoenix expert can show his expertise. I think we'll go for a fast one. Let's face it. It's just a fucking circle, isn't it? So Vosu pushing up into 12th. Lara dropping down into 15th. Now let's slow it down. Let's put these tyres on neutral. So, as Vosu is the man to watch. Lara. Oh, did you see a little blast from Lara there? Nice. Up into ninth. Just pushes up one more. There we go. That's better. 
Vosu up into 12th, just taking 11th. Lara's pushing for 6th. Didn't really have the uh, boost to do so. Why don't you cut any the inside there, Lara? I don't get it. You stupid fucker. Uh, Vosu up into 9th. And Lara's in 5th. Lara's having a good little race. Just got to keep an eye on these tyres. That's the only thing. Go on, hold off Landvik. Hold off Landvik. Good work, good work. Both these guys will take us. Mura and Landvik are so quick. Uh, Lara is on the tail of Channon, though. you got to remember, these guys are on softs. We're on mediums, too. So there is that. Uh, Mikhailovich has already pitted. I'm sure these guys will be pitting before we do. Who was that? Landvik just peeled off the pit. Uh, Vosu in 8th, Lara in 4th, is sort of jockeying for position with other drivers. Has taken 2nd from Holgerson, who is going to pit. I think Chan's not going to pit just yet. Um, neither is Blasi, actually. So, 2nd and 4th so far. Looks like Vosu has just taken 3rd, or is going to take 3rd. There he goes. Blasi's still not going into pit, surprisingly. His tyre degradation's got to be hurting, surely. Or her tyre degradation's got to be hurting. Um, we've got excessive fuel as well, haven't we? That's the other thing. So, we're going to push for... I don't think we're going to get the 14 laps out of these tyres, to be honest. We've got to pit one of these guys soon. I feel like Vosu is going to be the guy we pit around about lap 12. Um, we're going to conserve tyres. And then Lara will be uh, lap 13. We'll probably end up going mediums for the whole race. We do have a decent lead, I guess. I mean, it's not brilliant. So, Lara is 10.6 seconds ahead of Cooper. And 3.4 seconds ahead of Vosu. It's, I mean, it's not a bad, bad position to be in, I guess. Lazi setting new fastest laps. Unsurprising. Uh, I think we've just lapped last place twice. So we will pit Vosu now, and we'll stick them out on some more mediums. 26 laps remaining. Uh, give them 20, 18 laps worth of fuel. Uh, pit strategy will be fast to come out, hopefully at 13. Hopefully ahead of that, actually. There's got to be some other drivers who are going to be pitting. So let's switch up to Lara. So we need her to go that a little bit longer. We need to make sure Vosu's out before we commit to the pit. Oh, I'll get her rhymes. Don't want to commit to the pit just yet. Going to have to commit to the pit. We're running out of fuel. So 20 laps again, I guess. Parts are fine. Battery's fine. Pit strategy will go with a balanced or a fast. We'll go with a fast. Going to have to, aren't we? So Vosu is out. He's going to come out in... Well, quite behind the pack, actually. 15th. Did have a good pit. Um, can Lara get a good pit as well? She does have second third behind her, but... People are just flying past us now. So, can we come out in sixth? Can we come out in sixth? Come on, come on, come on. No, we're going to come out in twelfth with Vosu next to us. So, these guys are going to be hitting each other a little bit. But, that's fine, that's fine. So, we need Lara to push just that bit more. In fact, we need them to push each other on, really. Um, we're going to get you... To just allow your teammate through, alright, mate? Just don't try to overtake. Try to keep uh, Nahui behind us. So Lara up in the 10th, throws him to 11th. And we can take more positions here. We're going to take one position here. So at 9th and 10th, respectively. That is good. Um, let's have a look at this. Let's go neutral. And let's go neutral. Let's knock the strategy back down a little bit. We should take another position again. Up into 8th and 9th, respectively. Where is 10th? 10th is a little way behind us now. 5 seconds behind Vosu. And we are catching up on 7th, 6th and 5th, who will be needing to pit for us. Uh, that is 7th and 8th now for our drivers. I'm intending to do one more pit before the end of this race. Only, only the one. I would like to be able to get soft tyres on, um, but we'll see how that one works out for us. Sixth and seventh. It's not bad. It's not bad. We're doing well here. 
Obviously, Vosa is going to have to pit relatively soon. Got other drivers in front of us who are pitting. So let's make the most of this. Third and fourth. Where first? Second, first is all the way around here. Blasi's just miles ahead of us. Blasi's close to just lapping us, to be honest. That's how quick Blasi's car is. Uh, Pernet is just not that far ahead of us, to be fair. The fifth is catching up with us. Cooper is catching up. So is Soin in them. Um, but we are making good speed, I would say. I don't think we're going to catch up with Pernet anytime soon. Uh, how are these tyres looking? I want you to conserve your tyres, alright? Uh, Vosu, we're going to have to bring you in reasonably soon, I guess. Lara, push up. Uh, so, Pernet has come in, so we should be able to get to second now and third. These won't be our finishing positions, which is a crying shame for us. We could use these. Three seconds, there or thereabouts, between Vosu and Cooper. I think that gap is closing slightly. It is slightly. So, Vosu is going to go one more lap. First and second, lovely stuff. Yeah, Vosu is going to take one more lap. So, let's get Vosu in. We're going to have to give him um, the mediums. Give him or her. So, this is Lara. Vosu, there we go. Uh, it's 13 laps remaining, not going to need that much. 13, 16. Take a fast. I suppose they're going to come out quite a way back. Let's switch the strategy down to medium fuel and use the hybrid mode just to garner a little bit more. Uh, out of our fuel. I mean, we've got enough to get around, I'm sure. So, Cooper is coming to pit. Let's go back to Lara, who has Holgerson not far behind. So, we need to cut back on this fuel a little bit and probably go to hybrid mode. So, we need to pit at this point. 10 laps remaining, that's 10 to 12. I think we're going to go with them. 14 laps worth of fuel. Take a fast one. So, where does Vosa come out? Vosa came out in 15th. Okay. He has dipped down to 16th. Lara is in the pit. Lara's going to lose positions very quickly. But we know that's going to happen. There's still 8 laps to go, and there will still be people coming out um, of the pits before us. So, there is that to uh, deal with, I guess. Let's have Vosu shove past some drivers. Holgerson's in first at the minute. Lara's up into 10th. That's not bad, really. We've done well. She must have a very good pair. Vosu up into 13th still. It's just undertaken or sort of gained back positions from... Or just unlapped himself, should I say, because uh, of Holgerson. So 8th and 10th being relapsed thanks to Holgerson. What are you doing? Don't be sitting back. Fucking moron. Let's go to Lara. Lara up into 7th. Vosu in 10th now. This may be... I mean, this is... If we get these positions to end, these are successful positions for us. Let's not forget that. Alright. Gonna get him to push on the tyres. Lara is just gonna keep doing what she's currently doing. We're gonna let this charge build up a little bit longer. I'm gonna get Vosu to push away from 9th, hopefully. Lara's in 6th. Vosu in 7th. Who else needs to pit? Amura needs to pit. Critzy will need to pit. Holgerson, I don't think we'll need to pit. But we can gain probably two more positions here. We are up into fourth. And we are up into fifth. Holgerson is pitting. Holgerson is pitting. That could be... I don't think we're going to be able to get anything out of that. But that may be useful. Pernet may have to pit before long. Can we get ahead of Holgerson? Doesn't look like it, no. But we are on the tail. Interesting. So we've got fourth and fifth so far. Not got long left to go now, so let's just go a full out attack. Might as well. I mean, who's that in front of us? That's Pernet. Can we get third from Pernet? That'd be just absolutely fucking glorious, wouldn't it? Let's face it. We're not going to, but we should get fourth and fifth here to finish. Come on, Lara. Come on, Lara. Come on, Lara. 
it's not going to happen. But fourth and fifth, fourth and fifth, I'm happy with fourth and fifth. That is a good result. That is a fantastic result, by the way, considering the last race. And I am going to drink a toast to that with some more John Smiths. Oh, wait, that rolling ball noise was a widget. Cans of John Smiths have some weird widget in them for some reason. Still, there we go. Honestly, I think it's just a way of him taking more beer out of my can of beer. Dunzo. Alright, so Hawkinson got the faster lap there, which meant she gets more points from Blasi. Blasi didn't actually get the fastest lap. Crazy. Um, Lara's still third in standings. We are fifth. We're pulled. We're now 23 points ahead of Marshall GT. We are 11 points behind Grand Slam Autosport. We should get a good sort of thumbs up from the chairman for this one. At least I fucking hope we do. He's going to be a ungrateful fucking prick otherwise, isn't he? Fucking hell. This has got to be good. Come on. That's got to be in, what, a third place finish? Second place finish? Surely. Because all three of the top drivers were different teams. I mean, technically it's a third place finish. Cause first and second is the first. Third and fourth is second. Fourth and fifth would then be third. No, sorry, fifth and sixth would then be third. So we should have got second or third, really. We've got second. There we go, see? Morale's gone up. Toby Hart's relationship. Can this go up, please? 5%, is that it? And what the fuck is this? Minus 200%. Hmm. Alrighty then. Our marketability went up. Chairman's happiness has gone up by a lot, which we needed. Uh, we only lost 461,000. Only. <laughs> so Blasi is top of the group. Sun surprising. Lara's third. Lara's 23 points adrift of Blasi. Um, surprisingly, she's still up here in the top three at the minute. I mean, that's, I'm, I'm incredibly surprised by that. I genuinely am. I don't know how on earth she's managing to keep up with the cars we've got. So let's go to the mail. Uh, let's check out this interview. Uh, Vosa was being by Eva Blasi. Um, if Blasi is interested, that would be an amazing idea. These didn't like it. Blasi's got a new personality trait of... Oh, maybe? And um, let's finish that interview. I don't really care about our current drivers. Is this one a paid driver? No. So we're not going to worry about Blasi because she's like a million pounds. Um, got one race left on that sponsor. Got three races left on that one. Four on these two. Should get some more money in. Don't hire in 24 days. Do have hybrid power mode being voted on in two days' time, so let's keep an eye on that. The car repair is complete, so fuck off. Don't give me shit about the cars. You know it's going to happen. All right, new vote started. So let's go to politics. Now, removing the, the thing will help us, apparently, but I kind of like it. But I'm going to abstain. I think we're going to hold on to our vote. So, no hybrid power mode for next season. Interesting. Hmm. Interesting. So the next one is long practice sessions. Now, I'm going to vote against this. I feel like these episodes are long enough without an extra eight minutes worth of uh, practice. Plus, most of the time, we manage to get our tweaks in, don't we? Um, it's rare that we don't get all of our tweaks right. So no, I'm I'm not interested in that drifting. Hey boss. Sweet. Fine mate, whatever, whatever. If that improves you, you know, only gonna be five weeks and you do get an increase in marketability, but your cornering's increased a little bit. If that improves you, great. I'll take that. I will take that with fucking open arms, mate, alright? Let's have a look at our car. It's nearly done. It's nearly done. It's miles away from being done, but it's going to be fucking good, isn't it? I haven't even fitted that part yet. Let's go back to the car. That is a nice colour. We're still fifth. That's an improvement. That's still shit. <laughs> Alright, let's push it on. We need to work on the suspension. We really do. We need money to do that, though. So, Doha in 10 days. 
2.885 million. I don't think we're going to be able to build any parts for the rest of the season, to be honest. I think we're going to have to work on improving the ones we've got, which I'm not happy about. I need, I would like to have done something with the parts we've got. Uh, don't need to worry about this stuff. It's all bollocks. But that is going to be the end of the episode. Obviously, we've got Doha coming up next. Um, Doha is the fourth to last race of the season. Obviously, Skilford is a new race for us. If you have liked this episode, please do comment, like, subscribe, thumbs up, all that jazz. Check me out on Twitter, obviously, at Keggedy. If you're not sure how to spell Keggedy, it is on my channel artwork, so have a look there. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to go to bed now. I'm fucking shattered. And I'll see you when I see you. Bye-bye.